What's up, everyone? Welcome back to my channel. Thank you so much for tuning in and subscribing and checking out what I've got for you today. I have some drinks. Swoon. Have you seen this? Have you seen this in any store? One is a peach tea and one is a pink lemonade. They are naturally zero sugar with five calories. That's really low. So I picked them up. I wanted to try them out. Nothing artificial. Doesn't that sound great? Nothing artificial. Great source of vitamin C. And like I said, five calories. Let's, let's talk about maybe what's in it. Filtered water, lemon juice concentrate, vegetable fiber, fiber, citric acid, potassium citrate, stevia leaf extract, uh, ascorbic acid, natural flavors, purple sweet potato for color, monk fruit extract. So it's gonna it's gonna be sweet. I'm I'm projecting it to be sweet. Two total carbs. Two total carbs. With one gram of fiber. I was doing the math. I was like, how is it only five calories if it only has one carb? Because <laughs> there's four calories per one gram of carb. So, And this one is five calories, two grams of carb, same thing, same thing. And this one has peach juice concentrate, organic black tea powder. That's great. Stevia leaf extract, potassium citrate, sorbic acid, natural flavors, monk fruit extract. Non-GMO, project verified. I will put up here the way that both of these were rated. They were rated a little bit differently, but they were both rated really good, really great. Let's take a look at Snon Carbonated. Best enjoyed chilled. They are really cold too. I'll say that. We love sipping on something sweet. Who doesn't? but needed to nix the sugar. Thanks a lot, diabetes. None of the drinks out there had us swooning, so we got to work creating some magic of our own. We canned all the fun and flavor without inviting sugar to the party. Now every sip is extra swoon-worthy. Jennifer and Christina, tasteswoon.com. At swoon. Okay, cool. All right, and this, this one says the same exact thing. I paid only like a dollar for each of these. I'm not sure what the regular price is, but yeah, they're probably around, I don't know, how much is a canned drink anymore? $1.50? $2? I love the packaging on these. I think it's super cute. That's just really, really, I can't flip it now because I haven't opened it, but that's just a really cute packaging. Look, I can't do anything. All right, let's try the peach first. The peach. Tastes like a really light Arizona green tea. But, okay, do you have the Arizona teas? And they have one that's flavored peach, which that's exactly what this one reminds me of. It reminds me of a peach tea, just like it says on the label. But, you know, those have a lot of sugar in them. Those, well, some of them do. If I remember correctly, you can get some of those Arizonas that have less sugar in them. Like, they do have a couple of diet ones, so I, I can't say that completely. But this is actually really good. I like the peachy tea flavor. If you're someone that is not really big on just regular tea, it's actually really good. Or if you like the Arnold Palmers, which are delicious. Let's try this pink lemonade. Let me try that one one more time. Okay, this one has a weird aftertaste to it that I'm just not really enjoying very much. Almost like it's it's a weird citrusy aftertaste, but it reminds me almost of like a grapefruit aftertaste. I don't like that one. If if I was to get these one, I would definitely try the peach tea, and I'm sure they have some other flavors. But I'm not digging the pink lemonade. I'm not digging that one. 
I don't hate it. I'll, I'm going to drink it. It's not bad at all. It's just not as good as this one. When it comes to drinking something with citrus in it, sometimes it can just have a bite sometimes that, you know, that you don't really want because of the lemon. And that's okay. But the peach tea is nice and subtle. The pink lemonade, still good. But it's just going to, you know, have a little bit more of a bite to it. It's definitely a little bit sweeter than the peach tea is. So if you wanted something that's subtle, I would go with this one. If you wanted something with a lot more flavor, like a little bit more punch to your taste buds, this is going to be the one that I would pick. Both really good. And like I said, hey, I would be willing to try out everything they have because it only has five calories and, and they both... They're labeled pretty good. They actually went out of their way to use some good quality ingredients. And it's not gonna it's not gonna hurt you too bad to sit here and enjoy a little little drink. Of course, you can just drink some water, you know. There's no reason why you can't drink water. But that's all you guys. I just wanted to do a review of these, and now I'm gonna sit down and finish these. Have a good day. Like and subscribe. Thanks so much for watching. Bye.